Now 5.30, a community mailbox ripped from the ground and thrown into a car. The wild theft, part of a growing trend of thieves targeting your mail. Thanks for staying with us at 530. I'm Julie Watts and I'm Curtis Ming. CBS 13's Masson Kiwi is live in Sacramento getting answers on how to protect your mail. Curtis, I want to demonstrate what these thieves do. They pull up a car in the middle of the night and unbolt community mailboxes like this one with more than a dozen individual boxes on it, unscrewing it from the bottom. They did it once successfully and have come back for this very mailbox at least twice just this week. Lakeisha Appleton's routine walk to the mailbox is the best bet to keep her mail safe. She's had mail stolen before, but didn't know how far thieves would go. You see in this case, the people who did it, they put some effort into stealing this mailbox. So there is a underground market for stolen mail. Appleton's neighbor caught two suspects lift an entire community mailbox unit out of the ground and drive off. You're not expecting someone to take your mail or, you know, not be um, afraid of taking the mail because it's a federal offense. Postal investigators warn neighborhoods like this one don't engage with mail thieves. And are these individuals, you know, typically armed? Yeah, mail theft is a crime. The people who do it are criminals. Uh, they are almost always armed when we catch up with them. The replacement mailbox is bolted into the ground, just like what was here before. But this week, security cameras caught thieves attempting to remove it again. I do want to see changes happen. Better locks for our mails or how it used to be where each house has their own mailbox, so it's more secure. What's inside these boxes could lead investigators to suspects. No one is in custody right now. Weeks or months from now, a credit card could be charged or a stolen check cashed, answering who stole all this mail. Now, those postal inspectors and investigators say that if you see someone hanging around the mailbox early, early in the morning between midnight and 5 a.m., no matter what they're wearing, that post carriers do not deliver that early in the morning. There's also a $10,000 reward for information that leads to an arrest or even a conviction in the case of who stole this very mailbox and has been trying to steal it again.